Halo guys, welcome back with me, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Housing data, FOMC meeting, stage fix, earnings, three things to watch. Investing.com stocks wavered its choppy trading on Monday as investors prepare to hear from the Federal Reserve about its next interest rate move. The central bank's policy meeting begins Thursday and the decision will come out Wednesday, followed by a press conference featuring Chair Jerome Powell. Most Fed watchers expect a three-quarter point increase in the major mark rate as the Fed poses to get inflation back down to its 2% target. But there are some people predicting a larger full point increase. The Fed had, has made it clear it prioritizes getting inflation under control over causing pain to the economy, despite the recession fears that stains has created. The rest way from risk asset in anticipation of another rate increase has spread across stocks and in the crypto countries currencies with the price of Bitcoin falling below 19,000 earlier Monday before retreating of some some of its decline. September is usually unkind to stock investors, but people will be watching for the next round of corporate earnings to flow in starting in October. Here are three things that could affect markets tomorrow. The first one, housing data. More data for the real estate sector is due out at A to 30 ET, 12 to 30 GMT, including August housing start, which analysts expect to be 140, 445 million on an analyst basis. August building permits data are also due, and analysts expect a, a thousand point six six hundred and ten million analysts both would be down from the prior month month readings. The second one, Fed meeting. The two-day meeting of the Federal Open Market Committee began Tuesday, with most people expecting to see a 0.75 basis percentage point increase when they announce their decision on Wednesday. But we will also hear about Fed effect session for inflation, employment, and their economic. The last stage fix earnings, stage fix Nasdaq. SFIX is expected to report earnings, with analysts expecting a per share loss of 63 cents or revenue of 4,088.7 million. Stock market today, doom ends lower as high inflation stocks rate hikes fears. Investing.com stocks will but ultimately and lower on Wednesday as the fast pace of inflation indicates stocks bet that the Federal Reserve will be forced to deliver a much larger than expected 1% rate hike later this year. The S&P 500 closed down 0.5%, the Dow Jones Industrial Average fell 0.7% or 208 points, the Nasdaq fell 0.1%. United States inflation rose 9.1% in June to hit a fresh four decade height, topping economies forecast for a 9% rise driven by an 11.2% leap in gas prices and a 1.0% increase in food prices. This will be the last big increase with macroeconomic said as margins fall, which gains slow and a commodity prices decline, but right now, this report will make for very uncomfortable unco reading at the Fed its end. With just two weeks to go until the first July meetings, investors are now betting the Fed, that the Fed will be forced to deliver a 1% rate right hike, bringing the central bank closer to reaching a restrictive stance or monetary policy. Following the report, Atlanta Federal Reserve President Rafael Bostic followed further speculation of a 1% rate hike saying everything was in play. The odds of a 1% rate hike jump to 76% from just 10% in day earlier, according to Investing.com's Fed Rate Monitor tool. <coughs> Bank stocks, which will be in the spotlight on Thursday as JP Morgan and YSE GPM kicks off this quarterly earnings for major Wall Street banks. 
were hurt by ongoing concerns that a recession is on the horizon. I think that's all from me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe.